be cooking tiramisu today. Mm -hmm. Christine and I did this recipe like long time ago. A year ago? Yeah. <laughs> it was crazy. We had cocoa everywhere. Yep. So we're gonna show you guys how we do it. It's basically she did it last time, but I hope this time I can help more. She was very critical. I remember she was very critical of my cocoa spreading. Yeah. You were like, you're not doing it properly. You're not doing it properly. So I know. So I bought this so that we can all do it properly. Oh, nice. It's a sifter. Well, that's pretty good. Yeah. So the ingredients for the tiramisu. Mm -hmm. I have them here. I have it in my hand. Oh, you have it in your hand. Okay. So we need cocoa. Cocoa. Um, and then we also we need vanilla extract. Mm hmm. We mascarpone. Mascarpone cheese. It's like cream cheese almost. That's gonna be good. Uh huh. And we need lady fingers. These are Italian cookies. Don't use your lady's fingers, please. <laughs> and we need spiced rum. Yum. Uh huh. Can you oh. put lots of rum in it? Maybe not too much. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just, we'll just double the recipe. Okay. Usually I triple it, but we'll double it. Today. Double it should be good. <laughs> and we need espresso that I she pulled. brought espresso from her place because I don't have an espresso machine. And we need whipped cream. Oh, I thought that was milk. That's whipped cream. Oh, honey, if you drink that like milk, you will. I will get farts. Yeah. <laughs> regular milk. This is milk. Normal milk. And eggs. And eggs. So those are all the ingredients. Oh, and sugar. Oh, and sugar. Yeah. Hello, Kotesko. How's it going? Okay. So we have all the ingredients. Mm -hmm. Should we get started? Um, sure. We can get started. Okay. You just tell me what to do, okay? Okay. We need a bowl. A bowl. Um, a little one. How about this one? Is it too big? No, this is good. We'll need this too. Um, okay. Um, we also need a little bowl too, then I guess. Oh yeah. Oh, how about that one? This sounds good. Okay. So we need to split the egg whites and the yolk. Can you do that? Yeah, I can do that. Oh, okay, good. What do we need? The whites or the yolks? We need the yolks. Okay. So I guess you need, you can put the yolk in here. Okay. And the whites can go in there. Okay. Okay. Do you guys want to learn from the best how to separate whites and yolks? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to wash my hands. Can I get this? Yep. Yeah. All right. Or are you going to put the sugar there? Yeah, the yolk okay. goes in here. We need the yolk. Okay. And we're going to need to do this in the pan. Okay. <laughs> So this is what I do. I just open it and then I put it from one side to the other. And lastly, I just do that. Mm -hmm. And there you go. You get a yolk. <laughs> All right, so we need six yolks. And we need three quarters. Use a bottle. Why a bottle? I got it. Where is Maya? They're all See here. Her. <laughs> there you go. All right. Okay. Look at all these eggshells. So I mixed sugar. And How much sugar? Three quarter of sugar. Three quarters and of a cup of sugar. Okay. And six egg yolks together. Mm -hmm. And now I'm gonna add in milk. Two thirds of a cup. This is like organic milk, by the way, that I bought from Costco. Ah! Okay, now we have to cook this. Okay. So I'm really low, right? We cook it on low? Uh, like and we gotta move it. Low medium. Yeah, okay. This is like the important part of the cooking. So you guys put it on low, on medium, low medium. And you gotta move it and keep moving it. You can't let the eggs get cooked. Yeah, you can't let it curdle because it can get gross. Yeah, so you gotta move it slowly and you're making like a cream. 
It'll thicken up. It'll thicken, but you don't want the eggs to cook. Yeah, you'll have like sugary scrambled eggs. That's what you'll end up with. You don't want scrambled eggs. Yeah. He's really watching what you're doing. Fascinated. The cat is hungry, I know. He's like, can I get some? So Christina is cooking. So just to give you guys a summary of what we've done. We had six eggs, we separated the whites, which are here, and the yolks are there with three quarters of a cup of sugar. And how much milk? Two thirds. Two thirds of a cup of milk. And she's cooking it really slowly, moving it the entire time because you can cook the eggs and it's in low, medium low, mixing it, mixing and mixing it. It's gonna thicken. You want it to thicken, you don't want it to cook. Yeah. Okay, so this is what we got. Yeah. Pudding. It's like very mushy pudding like. Okay. It was like all watery before, but now it's like thicker. And it has no lumps, you can see. And that's how you want it. Okay, so the tiramisu is in the freezer now? Yeah, so tiramisu okay. is in layers. So one layer is going to be like the traditional cake ready layer, which is made up of the lady fingers. <laughs> okay. And then another layer will be the egg mixture with the mascarpone cheese will be another layer. Okay. And then whipped cream will be the third layer. Ooh. So we'll have in total of six layers. Lady fingers, mascarpone cheese, whipped cream, lady fingers, mascarpone cheese, cheese, with whipped cream. cream. It'll be so good. Okay. And between every single layer, it's going to be cocoa. cocoa. Mm. Okay, so how long does that need to be in the freezer for? Um, ideally, you want to be in there for like six hours. But we don't have, we don't have time. six hours. Okay. And we yeah. made it like in 30 minutes last time, so we okay. can keep it. There until we're finished with preparing other ingredients and then we can okay. Out okay. Yeah. Deal. And it's still butt touching day. Um, we can make every day butt touching day. Mm -hmm. Maya started that day off for me. She touched your butt. She touched my butt. Nice. Oh, that's a whipped cream. Yeah. So we're gonna make whipped cream. Oh, I thought it was already whipped. We have to whip it. Of course. Oh, so it's whipping cream. It's not whipped cream. No. Okay, you said it wrong. You said it's whipped cream. It's whipping cream. I said so. Cream. It's a whipping cream. Comes in a little box. I've never bought this before. And we gotta whip it. So are you guys ready for some whipping? Yeah. Last time we did it, we had to do it manually with like <sighs> yeah. whisk. Oh my god, it was the it was worst hard. ever. She's really good with it though. Like she could, she whisked for like thirty minutes. I tried for like five minutes and I was like, I'm done. I was like, okay. I can't do this. I okay, like, so how much whipping cream? One and a quarter cup. One and a quarter cup, guys, of whipping cream. Mm -hmm. Okay. And to make the whipped cream taste nice, you have to add half a teaspoon of vanilla. Okay. So now I'm gonna make whipped cream. Ooh, and vanilla there. And vanilla. Here. Okay. Okay, is it whipped? Yeah. I'm gonna open the lady fingers. Yeah. So this is what it needs to look like. Perfectly. Is that whipped cream? Oh yeah, it this is. This is whipped cream. Does it have sugar? Nope. Cause mascarpone cheese mixture is gonna have all the sugar. Mmm. Mmm. It's really creamy. Really creamy. Okay. And these are the lady fingers. Yeah. They are. So, okay. I've made this recipe many times and I always find that the lady fingers either get too soggy or too dry. Okay. So, I think we're going to try something new today. Okay. So, first we need to make the coffee rum mixture. The coffee rum mixture. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, how much coffee do you put there? I put half a cup of coffee. In yeah. There. And one shot of rum. I haven't put it in yet, but I will. Oh, okay. It's okay. And some rum. We're gonna. We're, so we have half a cup of coffee here, guys. It's espresso. 
You can use they can use normal coffee, right? Just really concentrate it. Yeah. Okay, you can just brew like your own coffee and just make it really, really, really heavy. Yeah, just make it really strong. Okay. I mean, you have to work with what you got. Where's the mascarpone? It's right here. Yeah, but we haven't mixed it into the egg. We yet. haven't mixed it yet. We'll be mixing this into the um oh, the egg mixture. Tell me if this is rummy enough for you. Okay. Just use your fingers. Okay. Ooh, ooh, yes, that's rummy enough. Ugh. I didn't even double it. Okay, double it. So we got our whipped cream. Yeah. We got our rum and coffee mixture. We got our lady fingers. And in the freezer, we have our egg mm -hmm. mixture thingy. So what I was thinking of trying is instead of dipping them into the coffee mixture, putting the coffee mixture... So I'm gonna wet this and put it on top. Really? How do you think it's gonna work? I don't think it's gonna work very well. Because okay. that's gonna it's gonna leave pieces of paper towel in there maybe. Okay. We can just do them how we did it last time. It worked pretty well. Okay. Like this one. And we just get them soggy like that. Here I can hold it for you. Okay. You so we got lady fingers at the bottom. And she's putting the coffee mixture over them. You have to dip the biscuits. Yeah, I've done, we've done it dipping them and they get too soggy. Mm -hmm. So I think this is the best. That one time, it was really good. So I just, I, I really think this is the best way. No, this is going to be really good. I'm telling you guys, like, this is going to be probably the best thing we've ever cooked in this show. This is good. Mm. Okay. Okay. So they're wet. The lady fingers are wet, but not too soggy. We want it to be moist, but not super soggy, because then it, it, you, we want a little bit of crunch to it. Yeah. You can put them on there. Okay, so we're going to put this here, and now we're going to... Are we going to do the mascarpone? Yeah. With? Okay, so we have the eggs that have been in the freezer for like 30 minutes. And this is eggs cooked really slowly so that they don't cook the eggs. Um, with sugar and milk. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, that looks good. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah. Okay. So now we mix it with mascarpone cheese. Okay. Are See? we gonna do the whole thing? Yeah. This is okay. perfect. Even the cheese has a picture of tiramisu on it. That's what it looks like, by the way. It's my favorite song. A big girl in my fucking way. Fantastic, it's fantastic. You can brush my hair, I'm just me everywhere. Imagination. Have you ever tasted mascarpone cheese by itself? Yeah, I have. It's, it's good, but I don't like it as much. It, it's not that sweet. It's sweet. Not that sweet, though. Okay, so we mixed it all. Yeah. It's ready to be okay. spread here. So we're gonna spread it over there. Yeah. On top of the lady fingers. So yeah. do we wanna do half only? Let me try. So we're gonna need again. another layer. Right? Yeah. Um so we can do half. Yeah, we're doing half. Okay. Sorry, I don't know. I tried Go. to No, I, I will tell you when you're like doing it too much. Okay, so I just put it, yeah, and spread it. No, ah, it went on your finger. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay. Yeah. And so then, we have a, a layer of lady fingers and then a layer of the mascarpone and egg mixture over it. And I think we're also gonna add the Okay. Alright, so this is gonna be really cool. Okay. So the cocoa. <gasps> I know. That is awesome. I know. What is this machine called? It's a sifter. Okay, you guys don't need a sifter though. You could just use a fork and like just sprinkle it over, okay? Mm -hmm. Just like that. Do you have a Ziploc bag? Yeah. It's 
small or small? All right. So we're, we're gonna put the whipped cream in here in the Ziploc bag. Do you want me to put it in here? Mm -hmm. The whipped cream? Yeah. Okay. You need scissors, right? Yeah. So we got whipped cream. Oh, a little bit. That should be good. Yeah. We'll see how this works. Mm -hmm. I had to do this when I was making macaronis, but... Okay, maybe a little bigger. Okay, and she's putting whipped cream all inside there. In a circular motion. I'm just going to describe everything you're doing. <laughs> In a circular motion. In a circular motion. Okay, so... Whipped cream layer. Alright, do we put more ladyfingers now? Um, cocoa. 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 Oh, okay, cocoa. Alright, so whipped cream layer then cocoa layer cocoa layer now lady oh, fingers okay. all right so okay you do that i'll go make more whipped cream house okay yeah so we got first oh do we have do i have to put coffee coffee on them okay can you do it yeah all right so i'm gonna dip not dip i'm gonna pour some of the coffee and rum mix over it these lady fingers. I think a spoonful for each is probably good, right? Yeah. All right. So on top of this, I will put another layer of the mascarpone and egg mixture. Yeah. All right. I think that's the best I can do. We'll have whipped cream on top of this. Leo. Leo. I can't pronounce this. Liu Shaji. So we're finishing the last layer and then we should be all done. Yeah. Then we can eat. I know. <laughs> That's what's most important here. <laughs> that is the most important part. Okay, is that enough? Just put it all in. Okay. There. So we're covered with whipped cream now. <clears throat> That's a very fat layer of whipped cream, I have to say. <laughs> Look, guys. Oh my god. All right. It's ready, right? <gasps> okay, we can sit in the fridge for a little bit. Yeah. Sure, we can sit in the fridge for a little bit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint you, but we're gonna put it in the fridge for a little bit, guys. <laughs> I'll let you serve the tiramisu because it looks like you know what you're doing. No, I don't. <laughs> You don't know what you're doing? No! We like to party. There you go. Oh my god. Okay. There. Alright guys. Oh wow. Oh the bottom is like crunchy. Yeah? Yeah. Like not super soft. It's good. Oh my god. It's so good. Oh my god. Mine's gonna be like. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Normally you would keep it in the fridge for like six hours, guys. Yeah. Oh my god. Are you eating it of the thing? I said this is gonna be orgasmic. It is. Oh my god, this is so good. I'm sorry, guys, but <laughs> maybe we should keep playing video games while we eat.